All right. Welcome back to Let's Help You Grow. Man, this always gets me every single time. I have to turn this down. <laughs> but welcome back to Let's Help You Grow because I'm here to help you grow. Um, today, um, topic, as you can see, how to register your song with the Performance Royalties Collector by using BMI.com with these simple steps. Sorry, I got typos. I typed this really fast. Stay tuned and watch closely. Now, I'm only doing this for BMI. I'm going to teach y'all how you can register your song because I know some artists out there still don't have their songs registered. Like, and obviously, um, you're kind of small or whatever, or someone would tell you. But some people, some artists don't have people to really tell them that they need to register their song on these performance right royalties collectors. You feel what I'm saying? So, um, what I would tell you is I use BMI. All right. So it's pretty easy. Um, I'm going to tell y'all, I'm going well, to tell y'all, I'm going to show y'all how to, uh, register this stuff. Um, so when you load up this, all you have to do is you just go to works registration. Then once you do that, um, I have way more work registered. It just shows one because I just did this today because I got a new song that's dropping on the 22nd. So I had to do this today. Um, you just go to add new work and it's going to do it to whatever account you're on. Um, select the type of works you, reg you are registering. I'm going to say all other genres because I'm not doing anything classical. Classical just means um, anything that's written, you know, like dealing with instruments and stuff once you do that it's going to ask you for your title so you're just going to put a title whatever the title of your song is not your artist name but your title like your title of your song you put the title of your song i'm just going to put bmi and that's the work title now this is the duration this is how long the song is so i i will tell you if you already dropped it just go to the song and see how, how long it is or what you can do is Go back to where you recorded it and just see how long it is. So I'm just going to be like, this is two minutes and six seconds. All right. Now, the work content, that just means uh, if you wrote the lyrics, are you like submitting the lyrics or just the, the instrumental or both of them? Um, usually, you will have to do music and lyrics because you're the artist <clears throat> and it's your song. After you do that, you just push next. Now, another thing is, hold on, I'm gonna show y'all this. You're gonna add another title. So say if it's say if it's featuring someone. So if you're featuring someone, what you will have to do is you have to put BMI featuring little Scorpio King. Now, the reason why I put that is because when it your song submits to Pandora, 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 my bad, Pandora or Spot, uh, Spotify, Apple Music, or whatever, it's going to be labeled as this as well. You know what I'm saying? Even though it's just named BMI, but the feature, you have to make sure you do this because if you don't do this and it goes out to stores like this and you got it like this, register, it's not going to give you no royalties. So you got to make sure you do that. After you do that, of course, your language is English unless you're from a different country. So I don't know, your, your language might not be English, but for me, I put English, but they got all different type of languages so you're good on that um the next thing you do it says this is other words so it says if your work is public domain arrangement or foreign lyric version it's like yes below this one um you don't have to put yes because it's not a foreign lyric version but if it is push yes um does this work contain samples or melodies um if it if it has any samples or melodies that's not yours, then you will have to push yes, even if it is. Even if you did pay for it or even if you got the okay from whoever you did, you have to push yes. But if not, just push no. But most of y'all are going to push no. Um, on a regular, you're just going to push no for both of them. Unless you got those. All right. Now, are there any publishers of, on this work? Now, this is where most artists get it confused. What it means... Are you a publisher? Do you have an own publishing company of your own? Are you a publish? Is your publisher CD Baby? Is your publisher TuneCore? Is your publisher um, ASCAP? Stuff like that. If it is, you'll push yes. If not, um, 
And if you don't have a publishing deal through BMI, you will have to push yet. Yeah, you will have to put no on me. You have to put no, because like this, it's gonna tell you you get two hundred percent. So you're gonna get. So if you don't have a publisher, your writer share, you're gonna put two hundred percent. I'm gonna show y'all in a minute what I mean by that. You always put two hundred percent if you don't have a publisher. So you push no and you push two hundred percent. I know some of y'all probably like, why are you going so slow and explaining it to us? Um, <laughs> Explaining us to it like this because some people really don't understand, man. I promise you because I didn't really understand it some time ago myself. So, on this, you just pick a writer and whatever, whatever, um, a writer it is, that's what you push, like that's what you put, um, your name obviously, and the role. Now, the role, I know this can be confusing as well. Put composer and author if you're an artist, if you sung, whether you sung the song or you, um, you know rap the song you always put composer and author now affiliation is bmi because i'm with bmi as a, as a songwriter now the writer share this is what i was talking about you're gonna put 200 percent unless unless you're you and the producer like whoever produced the song if y'all discussed then you can give him you probably gonna give him like 50 percent so if you give him 50 percent you're gonna put 150 all right now if you got a publishing deal you got a publishing deal you're gonna have to put a hundred because it's gonna go a hundred to the writer and a hundred to the publisher but if you don't have a publishing deal and you just an artist and stuff like that you're just gonna pretty much put 200 if you want to add a producer I know you do this like right here you'll have to add them right there but all the goals to show you're gonna put 200 um, now are there any artists you'll put yes because you're the artist are there any records you'll put yes because it's your song was this work created for film, TV, theater, or music library? Now, this one is tricky. Um, at least for me, it was a long time ago. This one, you're going to put no. All right? Now, you know, like, one of my favorite shows right now is Power, book two. All right? So, it's asking you, did you deliberately create this song for a film or TV or theater or music library? Like, are you an actor or something like that? Or did... They hit you up and be like, hey, I need you to create this song for this for this show or this movie. If not, then you always push no. You always put yes for these. All right. Now, <clears throat> on this one, this is add artist. So whatever your artist name or um, your label name or your band name, this is what you put on there. So I'm going to put like little Scorpio King. And you can put other artists or other band names if someone is featuring or something like that. All right. Now, this will tell you to add recording. Now, whether the song is on an album, an EP, or a single, that's what you got to categorize it. Like, if it's a song that's on an album, you still put album. Like, I just dropped the EP, but it's really listed as an album, so I had to put it as an album because it had more than, like, six songs or whatever. So it was really an album, but whatever it is. So I'm just going to put it it's as a single. And then you're going to put BMI because that's the song title. You're going to put the release date. I'll put the release date as it just dropped the date. Now, was this recorded at least by a record label? Meaning, did the record label have a BM, did the record label have an account that they, like, did the record label have a di distribution account that they got you on, that they released it, and you did it? If so, you put yes. If not, you put no. So if you were just an artist and you just uploaded, you'll put no. And you also can save and add another recording. You know what I'm saying? Um, after you do that, you push next. Um, and after that, it's pretty much gonna show like this. Like you can always go back and edit, um, stuff like that. If you want them to know any information, you put it right here. And that's pretty much it right there. Um, yeah, that's pretty much it. You'll just check the box when you're finished. I'm actually gonna go through this. So like, say if you mess up, um, push yes. Cause you submitted it and then you just everything is successfully submitted and what they're gonna do is they're gonna see your email but say if i messed up all you got to do is go to action where you see action push copy once you push copy you can go back in here and just read like whatever you messed up on you can just go through this and it will let you go through it and do do like do what you got to do you feel what i'm saying like once you do all that it's gonna let you do what it like do what you got to do you feel me then after that it's gonna send you a, it's gonna send you an email um, it's gonna send you an email about the stuff let's see 
<laughs> Just want to send you an email about this stuff. Hold on. Because I don't, I got emails and stuff that I don't want people to see. <laughs> but I'm going to see if it loaded up fast enough. Why is this not loading fast? Let me see. Hold on. Because I really want to see y'all. I want, I want y'all to know how the email looks. Like, I like set, letting people know, like, you feel me? Like, the the whole thing. You feel me? Stuff like that. So, give me a second. Alright. I got some stuff in there that not let you see. Alright, so I go in here and I search BMI. Alright, see, so we got all my songs registered. That's pretty much it right there. So, thank you for watching. I um, hope y'all been working. Y'all been having a good day or night or whatever. It's nighttime as I'm releasing this. <laughs> but, y'all, I got some more videos coming, man. Um, don't think I'm not serious anymore or whatever. Just a lot of stuff I have to do. Networking with people, all types of stuff. So, I'm just getting everything prepared as well. Um, I am gonna go back recording myself, so it's gonna be it's gonna be videos like me recording from my computer, um, and it's gonna be videos from me just recording, you know, in front of the camera. You know what I'm saying? I just want to give y'all content and help y'all out the best way I can because I know these it'd be simple information, and you will be surprised of how much people don't know. And I'm talking about myself as well because it'd be simple stuff that I didn't know. You feel me? That I'd be looking up. You feel me? So. I can help you grow in any way that's what I like to do you feel what I'm saying but if anybody want to work together um, I got a free constellation phone constellation we can talk on the phone I can help you grow um just hit me up please thank you y'all have a nice day though.